We think of memory as the ability to recall something, a skill, a name, a moment. But memory is actually the result of a number of processes. Imagine memory as a film reel. Short-term memory is the bit of film projected on a screen at any given moment. Long-term memory occurs when the reel is put into storage. In between, the short-term memory is converted into long-term memory through a memory hardening process called consolidation. One big difference in the brain, memories are stored almost everywhere. What we think of as a single memory is actually a collection of individual pieces of memory stored in different parts of the brain. Also, we have two very different kind of memories. Declarative memories, generally for facts, and procedural memories, usually for skills. Memory problems, types of amnesia, can be caused by injury or malfunction of the brain. In enterograde amnesia, the person cannot form new declarative memories as well as they normally could. The problem can range from mild to severe. They can remember information immediately, the film in the projector, but have problems storing those memories long term, the film in the crates. Memories of events that occurred before the injury may be spared, but events that occurred since the injury may be lost because they were never stored. Retrograde amnesia refers to a problem with memories that were learned before the brain injury or malfunction. This can be a temporary problem, just a block in at getting at those memories, or a permanent one. Either the process of putting the memories in storage was interrupted, or the memories themselves were destroyed.